What is up, good good people? Naita Yunus. Um, kari tena kwenye channel ni maisha chuo. Subscribe kama hodi subscribe. Um, and u kalibio kwenye jukua leto mbalo ni jukua kwa jile wana chuo. Tunashare ushauri, msaada, adwento, sunazo kusaidia. Wewe kukulaisishia maisha kwa ya chuo ni lakini pia kukabidana na changamoto yoyote. Yoyote utoka yukutana na ya chuo ni. So, make sure una subscribe. Um, una share na una chuo nzio, una like, una comment ambalo usala lote ambalo una, una tamani kuuliza, usala lote ambalo una um, unaisi na bitu liongelea kwenye platform hii kwa jile una chuo na katha kika just be free unaza kutana sisi instagram um, at maisha chuo uh, kwa hiyo unaza katu dm anytime about anything unaweza uka wasiliana sisi kwa namba za 0627975552 ukatumia whatsapp ujumbe au ukatumia message za kawaida ukapiga whatever just know that ukiwa chuo una msaada na maisha ya chuo ni platform iliyopo kusaidia so so anyway in today's video nenda kuelezea um computer engineering right so computer engineering ni ina unganisha ujuzi wa hardware engineering kwa mfano microprocessors na kadhalika na software development kwa unakuwa unajifunza vyote hardware na software zinazohusika right kwenye mambo ya computing devices zinazotumika sehemu mbalimbali right kwa hiyo computer engineer kifupi ana changanya computer science anachanganya mambo ya electrical engineering ndio maana unakuwa unajua mambo ya hardware as well Um, kwa ajili ya kuendeleza mambo ya kuendeleza au kutengeneza kuvumbua vitu vyenye you know vya kidigitali vyenye vinavyounganisha computer systems na kadhalika so kifupi unachanganya computer science na electrical engineering kwenye kufanya kazi zako kwenye ujuzi wako right uh, ambapo kwenye course nzima ya computer engineering unakuwa unajifunza mambo ya ya softwares development jinsi ya kutengeneza softwares mwenyewe lakini pia jinsi ya ku Um, your hardware za computer zilivyo kwa undani na kuzifix na kadhalika. Kwa hiyo kwa ujuzi wako wa mambo ya hardware ya software design ya computer programming na kadhalika um, unaweza kutengeneza platforms, applications um, na vitu mbalimbali mbalimbali kufix labda computer kiharibika kwa sababu unajua mambo ya hardware unajua so unakuwa deep 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 deep. deep. Kwa hiyo um ukiwa okay, kwa mfano computer hardware engineer Um, unakuwa unashughulikia kwenye masuala ya kudesign, kutengeneza na kujaribisha um, system za kompyuta kwa mfano circuit board, network, routers, processors, microprocessor na, na kadhalika sawa so, unatumika kuna kwa unajua mambo ya hardware like that. Ukiwa kwenye software unajua mitambo ya kuifanyisha kazi vitu vya software, um, applications za simu za kompyuta na kadhalika um, games websites najua mobile application network system mambo yote software products unakuwa unajua ujuzi wako so you get to be deep kwenye computer technology computer innovations um, hardware and software ukisomea computer engineering right so mfano wa kazi unazoweza kuzifanya ukiwa na um, ukiwa computer engineer unaweza kuwa computer hardware engineer right unaweza kuwa computer software engineer um, unaweza kuwa computer systems analyst, information technology manager, unaweza kuwa database administrator, unaweza kuwa computer programmer. Um, kwa sababu unajua mambo ya coding na kadhalika, Java, C++ na kadhalika. Unaweza kuwa user interface designer. Unaweza kuwa computer programmer, unaweza kuwa mtaji idadi. Unaweza kuwa multimedia programmer, unaweza kuwa Um, web developer unaweza kuwa um, IT consultant game developer unaweza kuwa information security analyst unaweza kuwa um, software developer unshaitaja na hisi nimehitaja unaweza kuwa data scientist unaweza kuwa product developer na ya mwisho unaweza ukawa software security engineer Um, so yeah that's it for today kwa wale ambao wanapenda kusoma course ya computer engineering niambie unaenda kusoma course hii kwenye chuo gani um, lakini pia share na wengine like comment na subscribe na kwa heri